In this Advent Computers Guide, we're going to show you how to remove stubborn programs from your PC. The vast majority of the time, removing a program from your computer is a simple affair using the Program and Features Control Panel. Click the Start button, type Programs into the search box, and click Add or Remove Programs to access it. Locate the program you wish to remove in the list, select it and click Uninstall. Then follow the prompts to remove the program and it's gone from your PC. That's the theory anyway. Unfortunately, there are times when this approach doesn't work. This video guide reveals what you can do to remove those programs that, for one reason or another, refuse to go away quietly. The Program and Features Control Panel basically stores a convenient shortcut to a program's uninstall utility. If this shortcut is missing, the actual uninstaller may still be accessible. To find it, first click the Start button again, but this time select All Programs and look for the Program Shortcut folder in the list. Click this to expand its contents and look for an option to remove or uninstall the program. If it's there, click it and follow the prompts. If there's no shortcut, click away from the Start menu to close it, then click the Start button again. This time select Computer to open a folder window. Double click the C drive and then locate the program folder either inside Program Files or Program Files x86. Look for an uninstall utility there and double click it to remove the program. If you can't find an uninstaller program then rerunning the program setup file may offer a solution. If your program was installed from a disk, reinsert it. The disk may automatically start or throw up an autoplay menu, but if not, then click the Start button and select Computer. Double click your DVD drive and, if it still doesn't start automatically, look for a Setup or Install file. Double click this to start the install process. If you downloaded the program installer from the internet, locate it on your computer and double click that. If you can't find it, go back to the program's website and download a fresh copy. When the Setup program launches, follow the wizard as if you were going to install it. You may find the installer detects the existing program and offers you a remove option. Selecting this should then remove the program from your computer. If the option to remove the program doesn't appear, then simply reinstall it over the top of itself. This should recreate all missing elements including the all important program uninstall utility. Once installed, quit the installer and open the program and features control panel again to see if the program is now listed. If it is, you can try removing it in the normal way. If you're still unable to locate a program installer or uninstaller, look on the manufacturer's website for program removal information. Start your search in the Support or Download section. Search the FAQ for terms like uninstall or remove. You may find that there's a dedicated removal tool you can download. Most security programs offer these, and some other applications like Nero do as well. Once downloaded, launch the removal tool and follow the instructions. It should hopefully detect your installed program, confirming that it will be able to remove it. If you can't find a removal tool for your specific application, there are third-party programs that might help. If you're struggling to remove a security product, for example, then download AppRemover from www.appremover.com. Click Supported Applications to verify your program is featured, then launch the program once it's been downloaded. Follow the prompts to scan for supported programs, then tick those you wish to remove before clicking Next and letting the program do its job. One program that will remove most, if not all, misbehaving programs is Revo Uninstaller Pro. It's not free, but you can download a fully functional 30-day trial from www.revouninstaller.com. Once downloaded, install and launch the program. Click Force Done Install, then click Browse and select the actual program file, typically from within either C Program Files or C Program Files x86. Revo Uninstaller will look for a built-in installer, which you can use, or if it's not working correctly, you can untick the box and click Next. Wait while Revo creates a backup of your registry, then scans your computer for registry entries and program files. It'll display a list of what it's found. Review the items in the list and then click Select All followed by Delete and Yes if you're happy with its findings. 
Next, Revo will present a list of files it's found. Again, review the list and either tick individual items to delete or click Select All. Finally, click Delete followed by Yes and Revo and Installer will remove the program from your PC. If you're able to locate a program uninstaller, but the uninstall process fails for any reason, you could use Revo Uninstaller's Forced Uninstall button. However, if the problem occurs with more than one program, see if it can be fixed with the help of a specialist Microsoft Fixit tool. Go to support.microsoft.com slash fixit, select Windows under Select a Problem Area, and type Program Install into the search box before clicking the magnifying glass button. When fixed problems with programs that can't be installed or uninstalled appears, click the Run Now button next to it. Save the utility to your hard drive. Once complete, launch it and click Yes when prompted. Click Accept at the first screen, wait for the troubleshooter to download additional files, and then click the recommended option followed by Uninstalling to let the program attempt to detect and repair any problems it finds. You'll then be shown a list of programs. If your program is shown, Select it and click Next to hopefully remove it from your computer. If the program isn't present, quit the installer and try some of the other options we've suggested in this feature.